A lot of stuff is just me basic gear that you're going to need uh, to get you through the trip. Pretty simple all right? stuff, right? Very simple, very basic, all right? As far as sizes of rods and reels, now that we have the anchovies that we're going to be dealing with this year, on a normal year, I'd say we'd be using 40, 60, and 80. That's what we normally use. That, that would cover from a four to a six, four to a six day trip. Now we're going to be fishing anchovies this year, having to go make bait this year, which is something a lot of guys haven't, have not had to do in the past, but they're all going to be getting exposed to it this year. From one day trips to the regular guys on the, the 10 to 15 day trips, stuff like that, we always have to make bait. But a lot of these guys that have been doing this one day, day and a half, for the last 20 years, basically haven't had to go out and make, make any types of bait other than when, when you're fishing squid or something like that. Okay. But we're gonna be, we'll get into that. As far as an anchovy outfit, what I like to use, anything seven foot, this might be a little, little longer than I would like just for tangle purposes. Uh, but just a 30 size reel, a 30 pound test outfit. Okay. And uh, as far as hook size go, I'd say number 20. That's a little uh, eagle claw hook there, but anyway, two odd hooks will be fine. If you cannot cast, a couple things you can do would be to either in, put on a small eighth of an ounce to quarter ounce rubber core sinker above it here, about 18 to 22 inches is, is what I'd like to see people use. Um, It'll help you cast the anchovy. You'll be able to cast the anchovy a little bit further. I know a lot of guys like to use a sliding sinker, um, but a lot of guys do not fish that properly. And by that, let me show you what I got here. Real quick, just to cover this, because a lot of guys are going to be having to do this this year. Sure. One mistake a lot of people make, this would be a sliding sinker outfit. This is the one we have rigged up for Yellowtail. You hook the bait on here, and the sliding sinker, guys, fishing the anchovies, you'll be using eighth of an ounce to quarter ounce. All right, now the one mistake a lot of people make is when they cast, this, they cast the bait out, first off, you always want to remember to hook the bait through the nose, sideways through the nose. That way when the bait hits the water, now let's say the sinker lands here and the bait lands four feet up here. One mistake a lot of people do is immediately start letting line off the reel. Well, what's happening is, that sinker, now that it's already got a four foot head start on the bait, and you just start letting line out the reel, pretty soon that bait's 12 feet away from that sinker. The bait's up here fighting the, fighting the sinker going the opposite direction. So what you're gonna wanna do, and th this is gonna help you out, I promise you, in tangles, all right? Especially fishing with this sliding sinker. You cast it out, put your thumb on the spool for just a second. As the sinker goes, you put your thumb on the spool, the distance shorts up between the bait and the hook. Then you go free spool. The sinker starts to slide away. Thumb back on the spool for just a second. It pulls the bait back towards the sinker. That way, as you're letting it out, it's going down at a 45 degree angle. All right, so if you were to just cast it out and let it go, when someone comes past you with the fish, here's what's going on. Your bait's up here. They've got to come past you. They've just picked you up. And for those of you guys that have ever used a sliding sinker, have been in lots of tangles, I'm telling you why. It's because you're letting the line out of the reel too fast. So this is just to help you guys, um, like I said, for the summer season, because we're gonna be having to go make bait. And just to help guys that haven't experienced using the anchovies, and later on, Frank's gonna show you guys how to hook them. Um, but it's just something that's gonna help you out, whether you go on a half day trip, Three quarter, whatever, up to up to an 18 day, it'll make you that much better, more efficient at at uh, getting bit on that.